sometimes I'm just like, what about Irish guys, right? Like Irish guys, they're always so nice. They're like the Canadians of Europe, the sexy Irish guys. Irish guys are always so fun and they're good storytellers. And they're good bartenders, kind-hearted, sexy, folksy Irish guys. All this time, I've been obsessed with aggressive Israelis and aloof Persians. I should have been after an Irish guy. Just imagine if I was with an Irish guy, Patrick. He'd have pale skin and bright blue eyes and black hair. And he'd have his blue eyes looking into my blue eyes and be an ocean of blue eyes. And Patrick would be so evolved too, you know? He'd be a modern young Irish lad. He would have had gone to therapy and worked through all that generational trauma and Catholic guilt. Patrick is his own man. He found his way in the world and he's into alternative music. Patrick is so good to me. He answers my texts right away. He doesn't play mind games with me. When we go to Ireland and visit his family, his mother is so sweet and his father has a bit of a drinking problem and is a little withdrawn. But once he gets to know me, he totally opens up to me and it makes their relationship stronger. And all of his little brothers and sisters think I'm so cool. It's Christmas Eve and we go out to the local pub in his hometown village and we're there in a little cozy drinking pints and there's people playing fiddles and it's so romantic and crazy and I'm just like Patrick I love you so much I can't believe I didn't realize I should have been with a sexy Irish guy this whole time I wasted my youth and then Patrick recites some sort of old colloquial limerick about how all paths lead to the right path or some shit like that. And I'm just like, oh, Patrick, you always know what to say. All this time I spent in Germany, I should have been in Ireland looking for Patrick. But to be fair, Dublin is really expensive and I hate flying Ryanair. And the Irish stamp in your passport is huge. It takes up like half of a page. Like, honestly, Patrick, if I was going to go there to visit you, I'd need a new passport in like six months. Ugh. It's not happening, Patrick, okay? It's like, get over me already.